That's it. What? What are you talking about? Tree branch. Tree. Oh yeah, yeah. there's like low leaf on it. None. And at church. None. Well, okay, we're are we stating the obvious? What are we? Flag. Flag. Okay. Gems. No, no, you can stop now. It's okay. Dinosaur. <laughs> Gems. Yeah, that one was pretty funny. It was a dinosaur. Tweaking lady. Tweaking. Uh, yeah, that's tweaking. Lady. Pumpkin. Okay, what are we okay. doing here? J okay. <laughs> Sh shut up. <laughs> All right, y'all. Welcome back. This is, I believe, is gonna be the final episode of this. Hopefully, we beat the game today. Last time we, <laughs> uh, we we got a ways through. I'm hoping that was a, a good amount of it. I'm hoping we got through at least like half of it, but I don't know. Um, we're just gonna hop right in. I'm not even gonna try to reminisce on the things that happened. October 30th, 1987, one day until the profane Sabbath. That's right. We have demon people doing demon things. I must stop it. But more importantly than stopping it, I just want to know what the fuck is going on. <laughs> Yeah, uh, sh dude, sh you're, I get it. You're never gonna go in the room. It's never gonna happen. I got it. Or maybe on the day of the profane Sabbath, you will. I don't know. I'm getting reports of children exhibiting strange behavior at the daycare center on 4th Street. If Nate and Jason are there, then you can bet that is the place where they will try to summon Malthus. There's no time left. Go to the daycare and find out what's really going on. Fear not. Vaya con Dios, Father Garcia. Okay, Mr. Garcia. You know what? I don't even need to check my basement. Fuck my basement. I'm not checking it. Oh, he's saying, find out what's really going on. So I'm wondering if we're, we're going to actually find out what the fuck is really happening here and get more lore about this John guy and maybe his past as a child. What 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 a fitting place, right? The daycare? Come on. Did I get pulled over? Are you fucking kidding me? <clears throat> nope, I didn't. He's just whizzing past me. Okay. But am I, am I stupid? Was I getting pulled over and just... He, no, no, surely not. Holy shit. What the fuck happened at the daycare? This isn't a daycare, this is an active, like, shooter scene. What the fuck am I looking at right now? Okay, well, obviously, I'm gonna have to sneak in, because <laughs> I'm not going in through the front. What the fuck am I looking at? Is this, like, a puzzle? Up, up, down, down. Double A start, like, what are we doing here? Ah, oh, yes, a perfectly me-sized hole. No, oh, that's definitely larger than me. Oh, are these, like, little tunnels? That's probably what these are. A riddle, priest. How do you make a portal to hell? Come see me, and I'll show you. That's not a riddle at all. You said, how do you make a portal to see me? Or, or to see... Okay, you know what? I, I just read it and I immediately forgot what it said. That's that's some elite level fucking dementia I'm having right now. All right, let's see what this is. Uh, who, who the fuck signed that? Ben? Ben, your handwriting sucks. But I'm not going to get on you too much for that. My, my handwriting isn't really the best either, Ben. A, B, C, D, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, P, Q, R, S, T, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Okay, I just want to make sure that wasn't like, you know, there's something wrong with the alphabet. No, it seems all right. Oh, you know what? Oh, okay. <laughs> Wow, that whole room is fucked up. Is there anything I can bless in here? Let me just double check. Bless the paint. Bless the paint. Okay, no, I can't bless anything in here. All right, cool. All right, well, let's make the portal to hell. I'm interested to see this. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, Gary loves us. Dude, I'm gonna have to fucking box this Gary guy because he's really getting on my nerves with his Gary loves you shit. Mother Moon watcheth her little ones behind a door of sleep. Daughter Chalice is filled an offering to the master in the unseen world. Okay, a whole lot of unseen world bullshit. Why is there a sixth dimension that we're talking about here? Spirit bird arriveth from afar and cometh back to roost. Spirit bird cometh back to roost. Are, are these like, are these like contrasting between like people we've seen in the story right now? What, what are we doing? These vessels are the unholy trinity. The fallen star shall guide them. What colors can you see? Look to the children if you are lost. I don't understand that. Am I like, oh, am I, oh, do I have to like bless these in a certain order? Hold on. God damn it. Where was I seeing that letter? Oh shit. Yo, can they stop doing this like fucking <laughs> droning in my ears? Get out of my head. Oh, it's Gary, isn't it? He's the one playing this instrument right now. All right, let me find the notes. Okay, mother moon watcheth her little one sleep. So moon, chalice, bird, and then star. Sure. Moon, chalice, bird and then star did i do it did i make the portal to hell i don't think i did it oh do i have, they said something about children do i have to like color code the fucking kids no no <laughs> okay um the boy what the star is red the the guide okay motherfucker god damn this is gonna be a whole thing this is gonna be a whole fucking thing Oh, I just realized there's a fucking thing down here. Can I even... Oh my god, there's more. Okay, I'm glad I noticed that and didn't try brute forcing that because I would have done it. Um, Okay, flowers. Fucking lovely. I like flowers. You know, I like flowers as much as the next person. Mason, age six. Mason is blue. 
Okay, well, oh look, the, the moon is orange here. Is that, oh god damn it, I'm gonna just write this shit down. Okay, we got the orange moon. Welcome, children. I'm not a child, but I am here. My dream, Kaylee. What am I supposed to take away from this, Kaylee? How does this help me? Fuck you, and your name's spelled dumb. Tyler, age seven. Uncle Earl. Oh, oh, Uncle Earl was getting crazy. Uncle Earl was getting crazy. I don't understand where I'm supposed to get. Oh, here we go. Chalice. Chalice is pink. Got it. Okay. That's right. I was looking for shapes in here, right? I don't think there's any shapes in here. There's definitely not shapes here. All right. Fuck. Yeah. Okay. Also, I don't know if we should count the children, but I think they needed like, what, seven for the, the death curse? Just three there, four there, but we saw like another one over there, so I don't think so. Our family. Why is there a demon? It goes father, mother, sweet little dude, even sweeter little dude, little cat dude, and then demon. Why is there a demon in the photo? Omar, age five. Um, what am I looking at here, Omar? Very, 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 uh, expression. Okay, that, that's just ultra kill, is that not? That's cool. Um, the demon over the dead body, okay. Yeah, where are my drawings? What the fuck is in that room over there? Hold on. Thanks, Satan. Oh yeah, we got bread. We killed four people and got bread, hell yeah. Stacking the dough high type shit. Yeah, thanks, Satan. What a dumbass kid. Thank you, Lucifer, for breading me up. Making sure my pockets were fat any time of the year. I got bread for a rainy day. Why does that keep swapping sides? Uh, L, age four, the scarecrow. Oh, the crow is blue. I think there was a crow, right? Okay, well, I don't see why we wouldn't be able to brute force the remainder of this, right? Meet our shining stars. I feel like there's a lot of, like, symbolism and shit going on here that I might just be missing. Oh my god, I just got killed. <laughs> Wait, that's so far. I'm so glad they did that. What? That's fucking awesome. I can just go out and get, like, fucking... I do, I got riddled with bullets. Also, the star here is red. I think that was the final color we needed. Dude, that's so funny. Oh my god. I walked out with a cross and they went, open fire! <laughs> Dude, that's awesome. Oh my god. Oh, and they did it in the rotoscope bit too. Like, bro, that, that had to be my, like, favorite cutscene I've seen during the whole game. It's like, it's the way they just open fire and go all out. Like, bro. It's fucking awesome. Wow. Okay, and then the star was- Oh, here we go. Nice. Call me the fucking puzzle expert, bro. I might be- I might be locked in. Um, what colors can you see? Look at the children if you are lost. Yeah, I, I figured it out. This is where it lives. Oh my god, they actually had like a whole fucking like pagan cult down in there. What? Excuse me. Oh. Oh, your eyes are quite red now. Oh, yeah, thank you. Thank you for letting me in. You know, I'm glad you guys have a garage gate system down in your, your fucking cult dungeon. Wow, they're gonna get freaky down here. That guy doesn't see me? You know what? It's fine. Let me bless this. Be gone, demon. Give me some lore. Here we go. Please teach me something. Something of value about the story of this game. If you are reading this, then congratulations. You are on your way to experiencing the wonders of the unspeakable future under the guidance of Gary Gary. Oh, of, of Gary, period, my bad. Um, anyways, fuck this Gary guy. Every time I see his name, it just it makes me a little bit more mad. My blood pressure just gets a tiny bit higher. Gary, our brother. Gary, our friend. Gary, a normal human being, just like you. Okay, well, that already red flag. Gary is not a human being, not normal, not a friend, and uh, not a brother. He's definitely not a brother. Uh, anyways, uh, human being just like you and me, not true. Uh, as a tier one acolyte, oh my god, they got fucking Twitch subscriptions on this, John. They got fucking, oh hell no. This is, is literally a cult. As a tier one acolyte, you are just beginning your unspeakable journey to eventually see what Gary sees and prove yourself worthy to be a vessel fit to experience the second death. Okay, more second death stuff, that's cool. Reserved for only the most worthy. Okay, you know, I'm, I wouldn't be shocked if this John guy has been through the second death, but I, I have no uh, things to base my assumption here on. I'm just kind of winging it. To find out if you are a vessel, remember to attend meetings of the Eternal Order of the Second Death twice a week. Follow Gary's instructions exactly. Be honest with him in all that you do. Do not ever ask what is behind the door in the basement of the clinic. The door of the basement in the, cl the abortion clinic? 
Do not ever ask what is behind the door in the basement of the abortion clinic. Was it the monster that was down there? Hold on, I'm, I'm confused. All right, let's keep moving. Also, I love the little gargoyles that are randomly just like, hello, good sir, and then fucking turn red when I pull up. She consumed six little twigs. Only two were left to walk as husks. Go ahead, priest. Stare into the eyes of my mother. Wait, what? She consumed six little twigs. Is this, do they mean people? Are they like, are they being like fucking purposely, purposefully alluding here? They're being like vague? Uh, only two were left to walk as husks. Six people, two were left to walk. Doesn't the seventh death, the second death curse need seven people? Hold on, I, I have notes. <laughs> My face when I can fact check. The second death curse. We, one must sacrifice seven by passing them through the carved out of the impure vessel's face. Then all... Okay, yes, yeah, so you need seven people. So what do they mean when they say six twigs? What? Hold on, let me reread -re that note. God, can I get like a go to the end of my notes or most recent note? I have to fucking manually click through them all. It'd make me mad. It'd make me mad, man. She consumed six little twigs. Only two were left to walk as husks. You go ahead, priest. Stare into the eyes of my mother. Who is writing these notes? Is it Gary? Is Gary's mother the, the, the what, Malthus, the demon? I'm confused. Oh, who the fuck are you? Um, hold on. Blessing? Is this the eye of the mother? Who the fuck is this? Dude, imagine if this was the nun from part two. Who else could this be? Um, it's not the fucking one girl. It's not, um, it doesn't fucking matter. Who the fuck is this? It's, um, is it fucking the, the one? No, I, I, it has to be the nun, right? This is the only person that would make sense. She looked like a nun lady. This a nun lady? Don't play with me. Don't play with me. Is this a nun lady? Okay, this might not be the nun lady. Who the fuck am I looking at right now? What the fuck am I looking at? My bad. My apologies. Hey, hey, give that back. Why did you take that? I was looking at that. Put me in here. The demon portal hole. Call me the walker. Bless, bless. Post-game ritual, pre-game ritual right now. Bless, 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 bless. Okay, I just hit the quadruple blessed. I'm, I'm ready. Wow. What is that? You know what? Fuck it. Hold on. I gotta read. Give me a second. Gaze upon the magnificence of La Piete Corota. Uh, this beautiful statue depicts a faithful member of the order of rece- Wait, what? Depicts a faithful member of the order receiving the second death in their loving embrace of Et Metea. Two such statues were commissioned thanks to the generous patronage of the Save family. Who is the Save family? We invite everyone to rev- uh, we invite everyone to rev- I'm having a stroke. Reverently approach the statue whenever they are in need of rest. Hey, I'm in need of rest. Oh, it's a save. Oh, thank you. Be blessed. I wish to know more about the statue. If you are reading this, congratulations. You have officially been granted tier two status in the eternal order of the second death. Upon crossing the threshold from tier one to tier two, your life as an acolyte will change dramatically. You may start noticing shadowy figures in the corners of rooms or experience feelings of lost time when holding sharp objects. That's an oddly specific one, okay. Ancient symbols written in blood will materialize on the floor and walls of your home. Animals will no longer trust you. You may emit a foul odor that will cause your former loved ones to avoid you. Oh yeah, my stench, my conqueror's hockey. That's my aura, that's not stink. Um, these are just a few of the marvelous blessings that await you in this new stage of life. If you remain loyal to Gary, your journey towards a sec uh, becoming a vessel for the second death will progress to new levels of knowledge and power. Remember, if you neglect your weekly meetings or do not pay your tithes, your tithes, your tithes, I think, um, to the order, your fingers will be forcibly bent backwards. Gary loves you. Gary, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do questionable things to you if you keep telling me that you love me. You need to stop it, Gary. I'm not liking it. Be gone, demon man. Melt. Melt like butter. Fucking fool. That's right, I just melted you. I disintegrated you. Holy shit, you're literally nothing but clothes. Oh my god, they all si What the fuck? What the fuck is your problem? Be gone. Oh. Gary can gargle these fat balls. I'm sick of Gary. Dude, this is such a pain in the ass to get past. Yeah, be gone, fuck boy. Okay, so I literally can't go this way. All right, I'm gonna have to evade. Okay, th those guys can shut up. Um, also, what the fuck? Okay, so uh, I see they regenerate. They reform. Be gone. Fucking fool. Hey, you want some of this too, punk boy? Come get this. Five seats in the north facing west. Five in the south facing, facing east. What? <clears throat> Bale giveth favor. The low seats are more, are made high. 
low seats are made. Oh my god, I'm not, it's like a chessboard and I have to do a puzzle. Or dog stirreth his pot full of sinners. The seats revolve. The seats revolve. Some summeth discord east and west trade places. Dude, th this just sounds like a whole bunch of bullshit I don't care about. What What is up here? Show me this. Whoa, that's pretty cool looking. Hello, owl creature face. I'm gonna bless you. Oh, I don't think I was supposed to bless him. Bless him too. Can I turn you off by re-blessing you? No, I can't. Okay. Well, shit. I'm gonna activate them all three and uh, see what the fuck happens. Let's see what happened in the room. Do they just turn back off when I go up? Okay, okay. So yeah, I need to uh, I need to do this puzzle and then turn shit back on. Wait, I've been looking at this for a minute. I don't understand it. Like, what what the fuck do I do? I can't move the chairs. I think they already follow certain rules on the board. So I'm guessing it's like the the step at which I enable them. I guess? So am I activating the ones I think happen, but there's only three things up there. So what order does it matter that I activate them in my- I'm confused. I don't fucking get this. I didn't fucking understand it, man. I tell you, I just- I just- I, I'm not understanding it. They, they, who, who the fuck is any of these dudes here? They all look like bitches to me. They smell like bitch in here. Like, does it, like, fucking matter how I- how I do this? At all? You know what, maybe, maybe, uh, hold on, I might be fucking it up right now, but maybe by interacting with the, it fucks with the chairs here. Hold on, so if I, if I were to mess with the middle just now. What the fuck? Who the fuck is that guy? Oh. Oh, hell no. What? Why did that? Oh, wait, oh, I see we're delving full, full well into weirdness. What? Oh, hey, there's the sister. Wait, is that the nun from part two? Okay, I might- Hold on, let me shut up and just look before I start spewing theories. Okay, me- that, That's Amy. Me and Amy. I'm, you know, exercising her. What? Okay. Those people we keep seeing, yep. I remember that. What the fuck am I looking at? Okay, that's me and Lisa? Lucy? Oh, hell no. What the fuck? Ooh. Okay, look at that fat motherfucker. <laughs> oh, and that guy doesn't have an ounce of meat on his bones. He's dead. Man, I'm dead. Ooh. Uh, that's Amy tweaking out. Me tweaking out. Amy's touching me. Why is Amy touching me? That's- Ooh, that's the door, right? They're like, don't open the door. Don't know who the fuck that is. Was that Malthus? Dogs are tweaking. I okay. A lot of this doesn't have relevance, but the, the the stuff at the start I want to talk about the most. Now you are ready. I I didn't know I was ready. Okay, dude that attacked me. No idea who that was. They injected me with something. I don't know what kind of Titan serum bullshit's going on here, but I don't like it. Um, the main thing I want to talk about. Me and Lisa were in an orphanage, and I'm assuming that nun there was the nun that showed up in part two. So we have roots with her, so that means we grew up in that thing, and that nun had, clearly had shit going on with the cult, so I'm wondering, we, we were tied with the cult at a young age, I'm assuming, and that Lisa was also tied with the cult, so them coming back to us makes sense then, and why we're so closely tied. Um, the thing that confuses me is, um, why? Why they want to contact us, and also he said, now you're ready? There's no way in hell I'm going back in there. Oh, is that where we killed, the, or we're exercising Amy? Okay. Um, do me and Lisa have the second death curse? Because, like, why else would they want us? Why else would they fucking care? Right? I, I don't know. Hold on, let me let me explore this house. But I, I feel like me and the yellow girl, Lisa, L Lucy, I keep fucking her name up. I don't know which one it is. Oh, that, that's dead as hell. Hold on. Bless him. What the fuck? Is that Mrs. Uh, Mrs. Martin? Miss Martin? I don't remember anything further. Why can't we ever go in the twins' room? <laughs> The twins real? Are we making up the twins right now? Because I feel like the twins seemed pretty real last time I was in this house. Why can't I go in this fucking room? I don't remember anything further. Oh, you know what? Maybe the reason we can't go in there is because we never went in there on the, the first time we went in. Maybe. Family portrait. Really fucked up. Amy's geeking. Wait. Oh yeah, Amy's head's fine, but it looks like Mr. and Mrs. heads are kind of chopped off. What's on the fridge? Peeping? Oh. Is that the church where we grew up? And then there's the two things there that we keep seeing. Some- Wait, did that say Martin on the, the drawing? Amy Martin. Oh, Amy- Amy drew this. Okay. 
I, I just want to do a few, or not a few laps. I, that'd be stupid. I just want to do my initial lap around the crib and make sure everything's good. Okay, there's another dead person. I'm assuming that is uh, Mr. Martin. Am I right? I'm guessing that's Mr. Martin. Mr. and Mrs. Martin dead in the crib. Can I see my reflection? Can I see my reflection? <laughs> I can. All right, let's get moving. <clears throat> I could leave the crib. I don't want to leave just yet. I want to check the basement out. Because if everyone's dead in here, I would assume Father Allred would be dead in the basement. Perhaps. Slip. Father Ward, please come quickly. You know what? Fuck you. I'm going to leave now. Just because you said that... Oh, do you hear it like glitch and get louder? Oh, fuck no. No, I'm okay. No, I, I don't want to come quickly. I'm, I'm okay. I'll take my time. Pause. Wow, that's freaky. Yeah, my face when I leave the house. Oh. He said, it's, it's right behind me, isn't it? Oh. She said, you're really leaving, huh? Oh my god, okay, the hand demon coming out of her mouth. Why, why is, what is with them and this hand demon? Oh, son of a bitch, I wanted to explore the basement. I did that to spite him, god damn it. No. And now I'm stuck behind the gate. Okay, now fun. Well, nothing I can do about that. I just missed potential, I don't know, really important look. Wow. Oh, look, that one's still alive. That one's crawling on the floor. He said, please. And then I walk over to him, and I go, good douche, be exercised. Wow. I... Dude, everyone, look at, it's, is that their intestines It's that are, like, split out? That's crazy looking. All right, where's this Gibby guy, or the Gabe? Who, who keeps saying they love you? Oh. Oh, no. The fuck is this? Deliver two into Moloch's hands before opening his ma his navel. Um, deliver two, do they mean, like, me and, uh, Lisa? Is that what we're getting at here? That might be what we're getting at here. Or it's just a part of a puzzle, like on some Resident Evil door type shit, and we just have to get two. Now it's definitely a puzzle that we have to get two for. All right, am I level three now? Okay. Filthy acolyte, the substance of Gary's influence flows through your veins. You are corrupted beyond repair. Your family and friends have forsaken you. There is no returning from the path you have chosen. Only Gary can save you now. Give up and fully let him into your heart and mind. If you do so, he will make you into a vessel worthy of the unspeakable. Resist, and your soul will be lost forever. Welcome to tier three. Gary loves you. Gary, I'm gonna... I'm gonna do crazy things to you, Gary. All right. And who might this lovely painting be of? Looks like the nun lady from part two. We keep seeing this fucking nun lady. Why does it matter? Why does it matter that we keep seeing the nun lady? It's like, oh, I grew up with her, actually. Oh, you know what? That might actually be why we keep seeing her. It's because we grew up with the nun lady. She, like, raised us. Raised us for the cult. We were, like, indoctrinated since birth. Since birth. What the fuck am I looking at? What is this? So much random bullshit in here. They hired an interior designer and he came through and just started wasting their budget. He's like, eh, fuck it. Put a statue of a goat in here for fun. Fuck, why not? What? Why did that... Why did that do that? Okay. Well, now we got red in the walls. I got red in the walls. Does that change this thingy here? Oh, look. We got little heart torches in here. You know, now I'm... What? Uod to in some fucking, I don't know, whatever the language that dude was speaking. I, I ain't never heard that shit before. Oh my god, I've looped. Oh no. Okay. I see we're gonna have to loop a few times here. Uh, quad to istis fumi. I don't know why I bother reading it. It's not like I'm gonna fucking understand it the second time. <laughs> quad sumus ir iritis tu. Yeah, yeah, whatever. You got me saying a bunch, a whole bunch of bullshit. How about you give me the Taco Bell menu? And that's all that fucking matters. Oh, oh no. Oh, he gobbled my ass up. He said, mmm, delicious. Yo, fuck this guy. No, 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 no. No, I'm gonna have to fight him now. Because what was that? What do you mean? He just gobbled my ass up and then was, that was that. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. He wants to play. We're gonna play. Oh, but I really have to loop him. Oh, wow. This guy's a pain in the ass to deal with. I don't like this guy at all. All right, let's fucking duel. Let's fucking duel, you rat bastard. I'm moving. Hiding him. My face when I fucked up the fight by doing that. Oh wow, his reach is crazy far. Okay, and I might be stupid. My bad. Okay, Alex, speed it. Just, just, you know what? Don't even speed it up. Just cut. And then I run. Yeah, look at you, dumb boy, dumb little fucking idiot, stupid ass boy. Yeah, look at you. You're like ancient now. You're fat and old. Fucking dust in in my eyes. That's what you are. You're nothing but dust. Dust for me to collect and do with as I please. Oh my god, I have to fight you again. I might be stupid. My bad. What? Are you? Are you? Are you serious, Bruno? I. Oh. 
I'm gonna tweak. I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna do some horrible thing. Hey, what's up, fuck fella? I hate you. I hate you so much. Oh my. Oh my god. Wait, he let me go. He let me go, and I was in the middle of my tweak IRL that I I didn't really. I don't like you very much, little little goblin bubblegum pink man. Dude, I'm getting real sicky, little bubblegum worm pink man. God, no. Oh, you really- you can literally just break free. What? Okay, well, no, he just gobbled my ass up. What do you mean? You know what? No, it's just a skill issue. It's a skill issue. It's a- it's a one trillion percent a skill issue. But I- I- I feel like I have every right to be angry in this position right now. Even if I didn't. I'd still be pressed. I mean, tell me this little gummy worm gumdrop bastard is able to give me this much work? Why? I get this is like, you know, we're coming to a head here, a conclusion of the story, perhaps, maybe, slightly, I hope. But like, that doesn't give this random cultist dumbass dude the, the, the methods and the facilities to just dunk on me. Maybe it does. Okay, there we go. Fucking disintegrated him into ash. And now I'm gonna leave this fucking room and not fight him again. Fuck that guy. Stupid ass dude. Oh my god, that should piss me off. Now I'm gonna go right. And if I go right and find out that I have to fight another dumbass dude, there's gonna be issues. Dude, why do they keep showing me the pictures of this fucking nun? Stop showing me pictures of her. I don't give a fuck about her. I gotta save again? Oh, hell yeah. Wait, was this not where I... Oh, wait, the left went like... D oh, shit. Okay, okay. I remember now. That fucking bubblegum dude just had me so pressed that I... I'm now realizing what this part of the area was even in the first place. I have to go up. Got it. What the fuck is that? I'm sorry. I. <laughs> what? Be gone, Dina. My face when I'm holding my fucking bless button. Oh, my bad. Can I go here and serve? Oh, oh, hold on. This is a blessing angle. Okay, my bad. Yo, he's he's quite persistent. I'll give him that. Run, run. You get the fuck moving, priest. Here we go. Hold out the cross. Why are you chasing me? What's your fucking deal, man? Blessed. I'm cheesing this man. You know I'm a cheese. Oh, I'm cheesing him. Stay blessed. Look at my face when I bless him and. What? What am I looking at? Am I in a fucking asylum? This is story. What's it mean? Uh, you know what? Fuck it. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna move around. Oh. Oh my god, he's fucking here. You're bugging. No, no, please. Are you? Are you kidding me? And that was just a seg- a segment of the game? Why? What? Now this is different? What the fuck? What are we- What are we doing? I'm so confused. Oh, and his fat fucking dumbass came back. Of course he did. Why the fuck wouldn't he? Oh no. No, you're- you're fucking- you know what? Yeah, take me. Take me to the fucking asylum, you rat fucker. I'll play your game. I'll play your damn game. Open it up. Open up the pit. Oh, no, no, no. Fucking move. Thank you. No, you, you gotta stop. You gotta stop catching me. No, please. I'm gonna... I'm gonna freak out. You know what? Fuck him. Fuck him and everything he's doing. I'm going right. I'm going right. What's he gonna do when I go right? Not find me? That's what he's not gonna do. Oh, there's the nun. And she's walking to the church. I feel like they're telling a greater story here with this nun lady. Also, let us not forget that we're doing all of this to, like, fucking open a fucking thing. Oh, God, it's not another gummy worm, dude. Why Why would they put another fucking gummy worm guy in here? That shit pissed me off. No, please. My bad. Bless him. Disintegrate the gummy worm, man. Fucking idiot. Look at that dumbass little gummy worm bastard. You know I'm gonna have to kill him on my way back, too. Let's play Red Light, Green Light. No, I don't want to play that. Hehe, <laughs> never mind, I'll play it. Hehe, <laughs> I like this game. What? You lied. We did not play red light, green light, you rat motherfucker. God damn. And he just walks up and eats me. I'm gonna tweak. I'm gonna tweak. Disintegrate, 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 disintegrate. Turn into dust. Turn into dust. Thank you, fucking fool. Now I'm gonna go play red light, green light. And if this dumbass bitch... Yeah, whatever, let's play. Turn around. <laughs> I like this game. Dude, I... You didn't even say red light. You just... You just fucked me. You're not even playing the game. 
I'm sorry, were the rules inverted and I just wasn't told about it? Because what am I playing right now with you? Because clearly it's not red light, green light. It's, it's the game where you just make up the rules and fuck. Okay. And I've got this little gumdrop bastard. This fucking earthworm piece of shit. You know, maybe I read the note wrong. I'll give her the benefit of the doubt because reading is not my strong suit clearly with this game. Let's play red light, green light. Yeah, I'd love to play this game. You know what? Maybe audio isn't a cue. I'm watching her. No. She, she just didn't say it. No, no, I'm not I'm not playing this game. I will be a bitch about it. Yep. No. Yeah, you thought you could get me. Do I have to play the game on the way back? Oh my god. Of course, why wouldn't I? What? No, no, no. Move. Oh. Oh, thank god. You'll fuck her. I don't like her at all. I have to fight two of you? No, please. Now we just gotta, what, get this piece back without getting destroyed by the, the guy that I know is coming right now? Where is he? Where is he? Just show me the heart creature that's fucking pursuing me hot on my ass. Okay, the nun, is she changing in these photos? Am I hearing this correctly? Or not hearing this correctly, but seeing this? Okay, let me get a little save in type shit. Hello, demon creature. I bring you uh, some offerings. Here's one, and uh, here's two. I don't know what that puzzle game is with the other dude, but um, I'm not gonna play it because I just don't give a fuck. Deliver two into Moloch's hands before opening his navel. I, I did. I open. I hey hey dickhead. I've delivered them into your fucking navel. What do you want to see my balls? What are we doing here? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Just make up rules. I I already know what you want me to do. You want me to go fight the heart, dude? That's what you're waiting for. You want me? To go deal with that stupid ass heart dude and that fucking asylum mechanic. Don't worry, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do the mechanic. It's not gonna be fun for you though. I'm just letting you know this now. I'm letting you know fucking now. Stupid ass heart dude. Man, why don't you come fucking play with me? Let's play some games then, punk boy. I'm locked in. I will not fail this. If I fail this, um, punch my grandma on the throat. Oh. Open, open, open. Oh my god, please. Oh my god, open. Open. No, no, don't do this to me. Are you fucking kidding me? How am I supposed to RNG this? Do you want me to turn back and, and get him to follow me up the fucking thing? You're like, what? Do I have to RNG the fucking... Uh, yeah. I'm tweaking. Hi, Mr. Heart Creature Dude. You can go kick rocks. Oh, yeah, that's right. Why don't you come face me? i like, fucking purify you. Yeah, how'd, that, how'd that taste? Is that delicious? Is that yummy? What the fuck? This goes up even more? How? Why? Oh, hello, would you like to kill the guy in that cage? No, it's okay, you don't have to. Well, I'm really hauling ass in here, huh? Is this the piece? No, it's okay, I, I, I just, I just wanted that thing there that, like, there were so many new mechanics and things that were showing me there, and I didn't get to see him, because, you know, Mr. Red Heart fucking jackass wants to play games with me. It's alright. I can't bless him either, because I'm gonna fucking stray jacket, because why wouldn't I be? Oh my god, I'm so dead. There's literally no... Oh my god, I fucking did it. Okay. Yeah, take me to the pearly white gates of fucking heaven, please. Get me out of here. Oh, thank you, God, for blessing me. And you know what's crazy is he's gonna come right back. What are we doing here? What is happening? Oh, shit. Oh my god. What? What? Why did I fucking combust? Are you, are you being for real right now? Why would they... What is this? What What is this like fucking gate thing? Is this like mirror the room? What What are we doing? What is this? I, I don't I don't get that. Like full and well, I just don't understand that. What What is the gimmick in that room? Is there something here I can bless and like read? I would be wicked. I don't like the look of this gloomy wooden table. Okay, do something about it, punk boy. What a useless remark. Why are you gonna tell me shit about the table and then have it not fucking matter? Am I understanding this correctly? Look, it's gonna like grow shit back. Why does this crack? What What is this? Oh, and then, okay, I think I kind of get what's going on here. What the fuck? Okay, so I'm, I'm fighting the thing in the mirror. Did I get it? Okay, I got it. Cool. Type shit. Okay, I figured it out. Me smart. Okay, now the glass is just tweaking out. I don't know what's going on with the glass up here, but I'm getting the hell out of here. It's not my problem. I got the fucking gem of bullshit that I needed or something. I don't fucking know. Yeah, here, here, I delivered it. Get me the fuck in here. Oh, thank you. 
diving in too deep. Go into the belly of the beast. Yeah. Ooh. That's like fucking okay, that's cool. In we go. Ooh. Fuck is in here. You are now a tier four acolyte. You have descended beyond everything that could possibly save you. Okay, you guys said that for tier three as well, but like now like are we now officially here? Or like when when does the cool shit start happening? Your words are not your own. Your actions are not your own. You belong body and spirit to Gary. Your face itches for the warm embrace of the ritual mask. You long for the blinding pain of the knife. You truly are Gary's chosen vessel. Fear not. Only a little longer and you will experience the second death. Adios, Alma Pradita. Gary loves you. I, I have a feeling this guy has already experienced the second death. I might be wrong though. Partake of the dark. So where did I come from? Did I come from here? Oh, I think I came from the other way. I'm gonna be for real. I came from here, right? What? Okay, no, it just goes both ways. What the fuck? Oh, it's dark as fuck in here. Why is everything fading? Am I going the right way? I don't know. Everything is... <laughs> you know what? At least we got the cross. I think that's about all I can say the at least for. Uh, yeah, I don't even know where the fuck we are. I'm so confused. W what is this? Oh, yeah, I'm a fool. It's not supposed to make sense because we're in the belly of the beast. The beast. Mr. Beast. Oh, my God. That's what this game is really about. It's about going into the belly of Mr. Beast and traversing the darkness. Holy shit, a lantern? Hell yeah. I have a feeling I'm going to come back into frame with like a demon on my ass. Oh, no, I'm chilling. Ooh. Okay, now it's like ridiculously dark, though. I don't like this. I don't like when they do the darkness mechanic because I literally just can't fucking see anything. Blessing? Preemptive blessing? Ooh, it's like purple now. How fun. Oh, it's- no, it's really sounding evil. Wow. It's really sounding evil in here. Also, why did the crow do a drive-by on me? Did you fucking see that? <laughs> he said, Rah! Ooh. Hello, sir. I'm gonna ignore you for the time being. Oh, here we go. Here's the stairs that we did go. Oh, and there's more birds. A lot of crows. Apparently, Malthus has, like, ties with, uh, crow theming and, like, scarecrows and stuff. Um, I had someone in my comments tell me that, so. Wow. There's just a lot of, like, men behind this. A lot of, like, purple dudes just everywhere. Like, what are we doing? What are we doing? Is it purple man? Ooh. This time the bird did a drive away instead of a drive by. Oh. Oh my gosh, she was kind of... Oh my bad. Yo, tell me why the the, the lady in the thing kind of has some, some bunda, though. Did I kill it? Is it dead? Okay, cool. Tell me why that shit kind of has some bunda on it, though. You know what I'm saying? Oh. It's like a tree. And then this is another tree. Yep. And then this is a, n a lot of trees, guys. I think I've seen enough trees. More trees here. I love trees. Listen, I'm a, I'm, I love trees as much as the next guy. Oh, here we go. Yeah, yeah. We just follow the the symbols, the ritual symbols. Ooh. I. What kind of building could house all of this realistically? Because this is crazy. Um. Do I need to like? I need to like go around to do stuff. Is that what we're getting at here? Ooh. Mmm, trees. Yeah. Oh, there you are. Wow, you dive really fast. Holy shit. Okay. Oh, they said, oh, we die fast, huh? Oh my god. Okay, 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 hold on. I see, so we're, we're really getting serious here, my bad. I didn't know this was going to become like a wave defense situation. Where I'm just, I'm locked in against these demons with me and my cross, and I'm just fucking, yeah, the, the, God loves you. I didn't think that's what, where we were going, but alright. I think the middle is probably the safest spot, unironically. I'm gonna have to ball out here in the middle. You know what? Maybe. Just maybe. I'm gonna follow the red symbols. Maybe that takes me... Okay, that just took me to my ass whooping. But look, the red symbols are like kind of like a trail thing. Maybe I fucking follow them. I, I don't know. I'm I'm really hoping for anything that isn't just fucking running around and killing these guys for no reason. Because that just doesn't seem right. Uh, fucking here. Red. Oh. Oh, look, it goes up past here now. What? Oh, that's new. Okay, am I, am I seeing this correctly? Because I'm seeing a whole bunch of fucking nothing up here. I mean, this is like a segment away from- Oh, here we go. What is this? What the hell? Oh, there's like a whole ass crib here. Is it, is it a crib from part one? What am I seeing? Um, who the fuck are these people? Is that the Riddler? Who, who was this dude in the green fucking hat? My dearest colleague, Jacob. Thank you 
wrote the letter. I am delighted to hear of the success of your venture in Pennsylvania. However, it was not enough to persuade me to join your cause. I have no interest in crumbling ghost towns, nor government experiments, nor the gibbering behemoths that lurk or, yeah, that lurk shamefully in the darkness between worlds. Such matters are not worthy of my expertise. My methods may be more delicate than yours, but I assure you, they were given to me straight from the source. The Antichrist will step forth very soon. The second death will consume this world, this pitiful fleshy sphere still in its infancy yet, everlastingly too late to redeem. When the time comes, I hope we may reunite as cohorts, albeit not as equals. Love always, Gary. P.S. I almost forgot to thank you for the pet. I will keep it outside my private quarters as a guard against intruders. Huh. Okay. I don't know who the fuck Jacob is. I'm, I'm really confused about that. Jacob's not the, the other priest, is it? That That's not him, right? I don't know why I'm asking. I can just check my notes. Oh, Mr. Ward, John, I don't know. Okay, this was the latest for her. Father Garcia. No, 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 that's from Father Garcia. Okay, so that's not Jacob. I don't know who the fuck this Jacob guy is. Is there anything in here I can bless? Just wanna make sure. Just this photo here. I'm assuming one of these is Gary. I, I would guess the guy in the middle is Gary. That would make sense, right? Red, the whole cult kind of color association we've been making here. Um, interesting. So he has some kind of guard dog, I guess. I don't really know how I'm supposed to care about that, but he's got a guard dog, and I'm gonna try to avoid him. I'll take that as my, my warning about his guard dog. Red, ooh, red, okay, here we go. Red goes this way, then this way, then this way. Ooh, well, they almost got me there. That had me worried for a second, but only a second. God damn, what kind of fucking path are they leading me on right now? Oh, who the fuck is this? Oh, oh, did the seal break? Oh, part of it break, or broke. Okay, cool. So yeah, that is what we're supposed to do. We're supposed to follow the red trail. Got it. Go, it, I see. You know, I just have to not get killed in the process. Yeah, th this was, I, honestly, I don't even know where to fucking start with this. This was just some bullshit. I ran around here and I died over and over and over until I eventually, like, got them all, but yeah, this, this was, this was just some bullshit. Oh, thank God. All right. The door. Do you really want to open this door? No, probably not. I mean, where else? Yeah, fucking put me in here. That's funny if I just have the decision to not open the door. I'm like, yeah. You know, I'm I'm really not feeling it. No, I came all this way. Let me meet fucking... Oh. I don't know. You told me to come see you, right? You were like, you gotta come see me. Oh my God. Are their heads fucking exploding? Am I seeing this right? What the fuck? Be blessed. I don't know. Let me see Malthus. Sometimes it waits for the one who's already walked through it. Is he talking about me? I've been through hell? I'm, okay, I'm confused. Uh-huh. Hey, am I, are we in the deepest, darkest room where no one can find it? And do I happen to be a person who has been there before? I'm assuming if that happened, I was younger and in the church with the girl. Ooh, he sounds evil. My face when I come walking right up. Am I the portal to hell? My face when I'm the... What the fuck is happening? John. Oh, hell no. Was that was that a Gibby or whatever the fuck his name is? Gabe? Hey, what's up, bro? I, I, I don't know exactly who I'm speaking with right now. Who, whom am I speaking to? Yeah, you're gonna need Jesus here. I'm, don't worry, I'm here. I'll pilot us out of this. Oh, never mind. The actual angel fucking figure. I hear thee, God? John, son of man, what dost thou wish? Like, give me un unlimited power. I need to be like... No, 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 I need to be like Goku. No, no, you should have wished to be like Goku. That would have been crazy. And the girl? Oh, he's got you there, John. He's got you. No, John, John, you have to think about this. If I leadest thou to safety... Also, I was supposed to be reading this, my bad. <laughs> Her fate shall be sealed upon thine head. Come on, John. You know what that means, John. This is where we need courage. 
Get me away from here. John, lock the fuck in. I get it, you're scared. Swear it. John, don't you fucking swear it. I swear it. John, you're stupid. Why would you do that, John? John, you can't. You can't fucking. No. John, you go back in that fucking building now. We gotta go fight Malthus. John, what are you doing? You know what? I'm being too hard on John here. I, I get wanting to run away. October 31st, 1987. The Profane Sabbath. John, we had it. We were there, John. My name is Gary Miller. Okay, this is Gary. So hey, Gary. Yeah, tell, tell him. Oh, he's giggling. He said, <laughs> I'll tell you. Oh, well, he's... Oh, he said, I'll drop my whole evil plan now. Yeah. Lamb on me. Do I at least get to pick him? Oh, I do. Okay. What will you ask about? The injection? Gary. Oh, I get two questions. Well, clearly he lied to me because I, I don't get three questions. I get two. All right. What, what, what was the... What about Gary? Yeah. Who are you? I don't believe that. What's the real answer? Okay, that much I could get. Uh huh. The boys. Ma oh, I get to pick between one or the other. Okay, I see how this is working. I wish this would have been a bit more clear. Malthus or the boys? I'm really interested about the boy. Pause. I'm interested to know about this this one though. They weren't real? What? Mrs. Ma- Wait, what? Okay. Okay, um. Alright, so the twins were never real. Oh, but- Well, no, he says chasing after lost souls. Does that mean she had a miscarriage? Okay, Miss Mart- Okay, Miss Martin- they had twins, maybe miscarried two twins, and then they had the room set up because, you know, they were, she was expecting, they were expecting twins, they had the room set up for the twins, and the twins never came. And then, how does that affect the household and Amy? I mean, mom would be fucking devastated, I guess, but how does that affect the situation? Like, okay, do I want to know more about Amy or the second death? I mean, dude, they've had such an obsession about Amy, but I also want to know more about- Fuck, these are great questions. Why can't I have the answers to all of these? God damn it. Okay, tell me about Amy. I feel like Amy is too important to not know about. Why did you start getting freaky there, mister? Uh-huh, yeah. What did I do? How did I screw it up? Once I've completed my journey, what are you talking about? What are you talking about, bro? Now, can I ask him more questions, please? What? Are we gonna fight? Are we gonna run the ones? I'll run the ones with you right now, Gary. Oh, wow. <laughs> you can go and sacrifice none. On guard? Yeah, get blessed. Oh, shit. Oh, you... Are you throwing- WHAT?! You can teleport?! Okay. Yo, you being able to teleport is some grade A bullshit. I'm just letting you know. Oh. God damn it. Oh, I have to like go pick up my cross? John, pick it up. The God is with me. He said, oh no! Oh, he jumped me again. Good thing God is with me. <laughs> he said, oh no, I love how he puts his hands on his head every time I do it. Oh yeah? You think that is enough to- God is with me. Oh no! He's like, I can't believe it. Can I just infinitely keep doing this? No way, right? What the fuck is that? Oh. Hey. Hey, get this thing the fuck away from me. What? Rain of spiders? What? What? Yo, fuck this guy. Okay, he, he might have some serious powers. I, I was... I was... I was doubting his capabilities. He's serious. He means business. Okay. Why are you fucking me? Where's my cross at? Oh, I have no more cross. Oh my god, he's about to execute me. Oh, and now I have the hole in my face. What? I need to know more. I wish I would have asked about the second death curse, but I mean, at the same time, I mean, like, what does it matter, I guess? I, I don't know.
Not a big fan of this guy. This is my favorite move because it is the most. Oh god damn it, dude! <laughs> you are spamming this spider. Okay, I I'm getting real sick and tired of your spider move. I'm so for real, man. I'm really. You're getting on my nerves with this shit. Oh, priest. What? Oh my god, his head just fucking. What? What? Yeah, shoot his ass. Shoot his ass. Oh my god. Oh, fucking thank God, Father Garcia. Dude, let's lock in, Father Garcia. Oh, I'm not afraid now that you're here. Jesus Christ. Let's lock in, dude. Dude, that was an epic entrance. You came in and fucking blew his head off. You know he's still alive, though, because he's not human. Holy shit, what the fuck am I looking at? Alright, let's get rid of it. Okay, how do we get rid of it? God damn it. Well, what, what can we do about it? Can we bless that purple box? What do you want me to fucking do? You want me to go find something to, to, to stop this? Oh, do you want me to, to fucking do this? Oh, you want me to bless this. Oh my god, yo, shoot this. Oh my god, Garcia, you might be stupid. Yo, Garcia, do something. Oh. Garcia, how did you manage to shoot the guy behind him? Instead of the... Are, are you fucking kidding me, Mr. Garcia? Mr. Garcia, I... I love your work, man. I loved reading your letters, but but I'm gonna need you to fucking clock in right now with the shotgun, or pass it over to a real one, and I'll let you do this fucking crucifix job because you're starting to piss me off. See, why can he run directly through the? Hey, Garcia, you gotta do something about this guy. You gotta shoot him. Garcia, please stop being stupid for two fucking seconds and shoot him. Oh, two for two with one. Get this one now, dude. He's gotta like walk up here. I need him up here with me so I can like fucking do anything about this. Garcia, please shoot him. Garcia, please shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. He's in front. He's in front. Fuck! Shoot him. Don't shoot him. Oh my god. Yo, why can't they go for him? Why are they only coming for me? Drive by? Oh my god, no, you gotta shoot him. He's gonna fuck me. Gar Garcia. Oh my god. Oh my god. I have, I have a man with no hands holding a shotgun and shooting right now. Because why is he so ass at his job? Oh, don't worry. I'm cheesing this. I'm literally, I don't even know how I'm attacking this right now. Garcia, get the fuck up here. I need you more up. No, no, no. More, more up. Oh, thank God. Yeah, we're locked in now. Garcia, it doesn't even matter. It doesn't even fucking matter. Whatever they try, Garcia's got it. Shoot him. Shoot. Shoot him. You shoot. Thank you. I'm going to stand right here in your line of fucking stuff. Oh my God, we did it. Holy shit. That was instant. Yeah, I was, oh my God. Come on, man. Never mind. I, I just had to like place him in a spot that made what? Oh, I forgot we were in this building. Holy shit! When did they all die? What? What happened out here? <laughs> Ooh. Oh hell yeah! We got the classic whip. He shoots me for some reason. He's like, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm like, all right, man. Wow. That was kind of anticlimactic. I'm gonna be for real. Uh huh, okay. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Yeah, I was gonna say, how does that, like, affect your faith, what? Hell yeah. He's the goat. You know, minus his terrible- Oh, we said handshake, let's lock in. Let's fucking handle this.
Um, so are we gonna get a bit more like lore and stuff? So that I can like understand some shit, you know, a bit more understandingness ness, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Or are they gonna roll the credits right now? Because there's gonna be a very different reaction of mine to the ending of this game if they roll the credits. Are they rolling the credits right now? Oh my god. Okay. Um so here's my thing. I feel like there's a lot I still don't understand. And then a lot of them I'm inferring on, so I need a lore video high key so that I can understand what the fuck just happened. But here's here's what I'm guessing from what I've seen. Me and Lisa or Lucy, whatever her name was, the yellow girl. Um, John and the yellow girl, the blue and yellow girl, grew up in this orphanage um, with, I'm assuming, other kids. I'm assuming five other kids, right? Because the second death curse needs seven people. And I'm guessing that John, at least, gets hit with the second death curse. But that doesn't make sense because I thought they had to be sacrificed. So can they survive the second death? Like what? Ending one, a new purpose. The mother, the daughter, and the unclean spirit. Finish the trilogy. So confused. Okay, and then like what? So the nun that we saw in part two, she she had the second death curse done on her because they kept showing us her. God, I'm so fucking confused in how like all this ties together. Oh, and then the fucking thing with the, the Smiths. I think that's what their last name, or the Martins. Martins. Mr. and Mrs. Martin. Fucking Mrs. Martin, I'm guessing, had a miscarriage of the twins. And then Amy gets roped into this for some reason. He thinks she's like the, the Gary guy. I think she's a good vessel for the second death. Which then kind of disproves my theory about Mar or, uh, the main dude, the blue guy, being John, being someone who had the second death curse. Because he would then just use him for the thing. Right? Uh, and then the whole thing that's still confused. Why the fuck did they need the people with the second death curse to bring about the thing? Why was that necessary? You know, I'm I'm really confused. I'm gonna take a look at like a lore video, and then I'm gonna come to you with my thoughts in this final bit here on like the the culmination of everything. So I, I kind of like can summarize for you what the fuck just happened, just in case you don't wanna watch it. Okay, so I I took a little crash course on a video. I'm not like the expert. First of all, I did not get the fucking true ending. I think I got the true ending on the first chapter, which is surprising. <laughs> but apparently, at the end there, when we came to the thing, and he was like, the seals, we didn't get the fucking seals? Yeah, I didn't get the seals. There was, um, one of them was on, like, the floor, the seventh floor of the hotel, or not the hotel, but the apartment buildings. <clears throat> and it was that lady in that note that we heard. I don't know how I was supposed to get there, but you could have gotten there. Um, and then there was another seal, I think, in the abortion clinic. There were, there were a bunch of... Uh, there were three seals I needed to get, and I don't think I got any of them. But, yeah, pretty much at the start, John and that, that Lily girl, or Lisa girl, were orphans in the orphanage. Miriam Bell, the fucking, the fucking nun, had the second death curse performed on her. Unwillingly, apparently. And then, um, a whole bunch of kids start dying at that orphanage. Some fodder, some dude pull up to the place and try stopping the event of her some father dies M john and the lily girl go through a portal in miriam bell's face to hell but somehow on the way back they survive and then that means that they're they're act like possible candidates to receive the second death curse so john and lily don't have the second death curse but they're but they're possible candidates and that's why they want them or are so closely tied to the shit and then the twins were miscarried. There was like a lot of like trauma or shit at home, I guess, and that made Amy a good fucking target for Gary. And then also Gary is a Gary's a child that was sent back after multiple orphans were or like babies were sent into the, the, the face portal of Miriam Bell. They sent him back and he's Astaroth, he's a demon. Which is so crazy, and like, my main thing is like, where the fuck do you get all this lore from in this game? I guess you would really have to sit and get like, every note and piece this shit together, but like, but yeah, apparently you can like, you, like, if you do the seal correctly, then you fight Bro at the end, you fight Gary, and he's like, in a mix with like, another demon, I think Malthus, and then they mix with Miriam Bell, and it's like this crazy boss fight, and it would have been really sick to do it, um, but I, I just got like a different ending. But I think that's kind of true to my experience with it, and my uh, my immense reading incomprehension and issue uh, understanding the story, but it was really cool. And um, if you guys want to watch a fucking video that explains the story better, because I, I just gave you like the most shit summary of the video ever that I watched, um, but the story for this game is really cool. I can't help but wish 
that they give you a bit more at the start though, or that more of it is a bit more mandatory in the storyline, so that it feels a bit more rewarding towards the end when you actually understand everything and then it clicks and you're like, oh shit, that's cool. Because the story itself is really fucking cool. I like the story and the idea of it. I just wish it was presented in an easier manner to like digest, I guess. Um, but that was really cool. Thank you for the recommendation. And um, yeah, that was Faith. We're officially back on track for the normal list. And then I might throw in an, a curveball and play mouthwashing soon because I keep seeing stuff about it and I, I don't know, I gotta play it. I'm, I'm itching. But alright, I'm out of here. <laughs>